it was quarantine and Steven was losing his mind. I was. And I had a solo female adventure blog that I didn't really do anything with. And then I asked him, hey, like, do you want to do a couples adventure blog? We went through a ton of names and I come from a marketing background. So I was looking at ones that would have a lot of traffic and for travel couples, it seemed lovers had a lot and passport for like traveling had a lot. So I was like, okay, let's combine it. And then Steven bought his first camera in April. What kind of camera? I'd never had a camera before, so finally bought our first camera because both were already hiking and backpacking and road tripping all the time. So all we did was kind of bring the camera and set on our tripod. We have a quote we like to... Steven has a quote. <laughs> you don't have to be great to start, but you have to start in order to be great. I mean, last year we had no idea how to use a camera, no idea how to run a blog or how to road trip and adventure so much. And here we are a year later doing it every single weekend and loving it. So. It's a lot of time management. So just making travel a priority in your life. Like you're gonna have to sacrifice a lot of other things, but if it's something you wanna do, then you just gotta make time for it and plan out in advance. In 2019 for Christmas, my dad actually got me a rinse kit for my present. And I had no idea what it was beforehand. And then we decided, hey, well, this is really awesome. And we took it on a few road trips. And especially in Utah and Sedona, the Southwest is one of our first trips that we did when we started our blog. And it was 90 to 100 degrees the entire time. So it was really nice to have something to rinse off, especially when it was so hot. Yeah, that whole trip, we used it almost every single day. So easy to fill up and really, really convenient, especially on the hot days. When we felt super sticky after a hike, we just rinse ourselves down. So number one, I would say is this Reflectix. We use this to keep theft out. It's super easy, you can buy it on Amazon, but we put it on all of our windows. It helps keep our bed in here nice and cool, and it helps give us a little bit more privacy when we're out there camping. And we spray painted the outside black so you can't see in our car, which is really nice when you're carrying a lot of expensive gear with you. Just another reason to keep the thieves away. Number two, probably our fridge. We just got this bad boy, a fridge or a cooler. Um, it's, it's super essential, especially because if you're balling on a budget, we recommend bringing your own food. Mm. And that way it keeps all of our food nice and fresh. Oh, that's just pause real. Cause she's so cute. All right, number three. Number three would have to be our Rinse Kit Pro. We brought the, we just upgraded this actually from the Rinse Kit Plus and we love the capacity change. That's been really, really helpful, especially since there's two of us, we're both using it for a shower and now we got Karen, so spraying her down and giving her a bath <laughs> afterwards. We have so much water in there compared to the Rinse Kit Plus and it's really nice. We can set it out as soon as we get to camp. Usually by the time we're done getting camp all set up, we can go to it and it's all nice and hot. So nice little warm shower. <laughs> Number four, we have our Jackery. This is a solar powered or electricity powered power generator and we charge all of our electronics while we're on the go with it and it's super nice. You have three plugs, you got some USB outlets and that's also we can charge our fridge with it which is really nice so and it comes with two solar panels so you can recharge it if you're in the middle of nowhere and you don't have a plug in your car so that's an essential for us. Number five would just simply be a big water jug. This is our six gallon jug. It can last us about three or four days depending on how much we're doing. We use this mostly for drinking water. We can also use it to wash dishes and refill our rinse kit. Since the rinse kit is battery powered, we don't have to worry about pressurizing or anything. One click of a button, it automatically does that. So it makes it really nice and easy to refill it. All right, just finished exploring Liberty Station. Super beautiful little area. Now we get to go swimming with the sharks. We're super excited. Remember, live, di uh, live dirty? Live dirty, rinse clean. Why buddy. can't I say that? It sounds <laughs> I so got it, I got right, it. Okay. 